Kevin is known and loved by so many different people for so many different reasons. Obviously, I know him through, we're bond, our bond was through music, so I'm going to be speaking a lot to that. But I was just one chapter in this guy's life. He's been in so many different bands, Five Silent Miles, Fulcrum. He's my, he was my keyboard playing drummer. And I would, it would get so awesome and so beautiful. I would get distracted and I'd forget what I'm supposed to be playing because I'm paying attention to what's going on, what, what he's doing. He put textures on my music that never even occurred to me. And like I'd never even considered having keys. He reminded me that I played keys. And I can't imagine Mary Tree without the, without those textures now. And any music that we make moving forward will definitely have that. And all, as I've always told Kevin, no matter what he does, his soul will be somewhere in the music. And that will definitely be through the keys. Anytime you hear Mary Tree music, you will hear Kevin. Whether he's there, whether he's physically there or not. Um, just the, and that's just the drumming and the keys. The guy, he could pick up any instrument and make it sing. I've, I've seen it. Like violins, harp, I mean, I've, I've seen it. And you recognize what he's playing. It doesn't, it's not, he's just not pretending. He'll pick it up and translate it. And he, he made, he took our music and he sent me one he was just messing around with. And he took one of our songs and made it sound like a full, like a cinematic score, like with a full orchestra and everything. Mm -hmm. Blew me away. Mm -hmm. I wanted to put it out. He never thought it was good enough. But if I ever get a hold of it, it's coming out. So I'm going to. Um, he never thought anything was good enough. Right, exactly. <laughs> we what? We went six years and never heard anything. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but um, fin friends, family, fans across the globe, and that's not hyperbole. Susan in Germany, his fans in Japan. I mean, he used to produce music score for video games. I mean, he loved video games, but he used to make music for it. Right. And that's out there. It, right. Right. Blows my mind. It's and that's just a little fraction of Kevin. His right. music, as big as it was, was just a tiny slice of. Him. Right. Infinitely diverse music taste opened me up to so much that I never considered his jet. I've always come from a more metal background and lots of jits -jits -jits and all that, and he brought his jazz influence with his katink katink katink. So I I never heard any of that before. And, now I can't unhear it. Some things you cannot unhear, and Kevin is definitely that. I want to say that I'm very grateful to have been a chapter in this action-packed novel that we all know as Kevin Cornegy. Mm -hmm. My love to Suzette, his lovely lady and life partner of 16 years, his sister, his mama, all, his brother, and his son, all of his family, my love to you, man. Thank you. Seriously. I want to perform for y'all the last song that Kevin performed live in front of an audience. I hate how relevant and appropriate it is. And I want to say it's going to sound very angry because I am angry. You got ripped off. You got ripped off. You get, we all got ripped off. The music scene got ripped off. I am upset. However, stick with me because the message is not in the darkness, it's not in the anger, it's in the hope and the peace and comfort that we can get from that hope. And when you were starting to recognize, all you awesome music, you, you awesome musician up there, man, brought it at you. When you start to recognize it, feel free to join in. If you know how to harmonize, please, let's, let's lift this fellow up. On behalf of my band, my brother over there, my brother Dwayne, that couldn't be here because the life yes. gets in the way. Yes. And, uh, this is all for you, my man. Yes. Bear with me, I'm shaking. Take your time, brother. Take your time. All right, I'm going to try to do this so y'all can hear it. All right, we're still in tune. That last one, I was afraid that I wasn't in tune anymore. <laughs> When the spirit moves you, man. Yeah. Yes. <coughs> All right. I'm sorry. Did, did, did you hold that for me or somebody? <laughs> you, you were doing so good with it earlier. Thank you. <laughs> That's my job. Thank you. This song, this song is called Smile. And you can just hold it on the guitar. I can. 
They'll, they'll hear me. Thanks. Don't tell me to smile. Don't tell me you'll be here for a while. Don't tell me to pray. Don't tell me tomorrow's another day. Don't feel what I feel. Don't feel like explaining it to you. Bear with me. Don't tell me we'll laugh. Don't tell me have faith. Don't tell me that it'll be worth the wait. Cause everything is peachy. Everything is fine. But you're gonna get preachy. I respect what we decline. So do me a favor and let me have a mind. I'm not gonna say it for the thousand times. It'll always be this way. It'll always be this way. So have a nice day. Don't tell me you know. Don't tell me this pain's to help me grow. Don't tell me you care. Not too interested in your thoughts or prayers. Don't tell me to dream. Don't tell me there's a reason for everything. Don't tell me we'll laugh. Don't tell me that this year shall pass. Cause everything is peachy, everything is fine. But if you got it, get preachy, I respect what we decline. Do me a favor and let me have a mind. But really, you gotta say it for the thousand times. It'll always be a swing. It'll always be a swing. At the end of the day, 